Okay, all right, all right. Okay, guys, let's review checklist. The Color Beanie Crew, check. Tom Allen, check. Um, Edward Scott, check. Rebel Wilson, check. All right, we're all ready for the show tonight. All right, everybody, places, everybody. Ellie, you are on in 20 seconds. 20 seconds? Oh, we better go. Yeah, come on. Oh, we better do this. Yeah. Oh, man. I'm so excited. Best of luck, my schmoochie poo. Oh, thanks, the camel lady. All right, 15 seconds. Oh, I better do the intro for the camel lady. I better absolutely do another thing. I better do the intro of the introduction of the show. 10 seconds. Okay, uh, it's just me. Yep. You really got to impress the audience. Mm-hmm. All right, we're live in five, four, three, two, one, and action! What's up? I wonder what's coming up next. It's Weeknight Update with Ellie Mueller. Awesome guy. <laughs> and the morning show starting Reb, Reb, Rebel Wilson. There we go. <laughs> and extremely early with Edward Scott. And it's all still to come on Nick and Knight. Peace. From the point of view to Tokyo. All way from wherever Mrs. Tomei is right now. It's weak up there with Ellie Mule. And now, man, I have to talk about Mrs. Tomei tonight on this program because he's the one who plans everything out for this program. Oh, let's just get this over with before I say something ridiculous. Mr. Ellie Connie Mule. Ha! Welcome to Week 9 Update. I'm Ellie Gordon. What's up? What's up? Tom Allen, everybody. Tom Allen. Hey, boss. Hey, Tom. What's up? Nothing much. What's up with you? Nothing much. All right. Let's get on with the show, huh? Yeah. Good idea. Uh, this week's content week question is, would you rather control the weather or help me launch a campaign to get a celebrity like Jordan Sparks on Week 9 Update? Go over to the community tab post and answer that question as honestly and as thoughtfully as you can. Ah, the theme song is composed by Dominic Mattis Piano. The cover being included, the Camel Lady and E-Rabbit, the Grand Level 2004, are responsible for some of the things that you will see and hear on this program tonight, and they are some of our Shadow Spotlight winners tonight, as you may or may not know. Our other Shadow Spotlight winners tonight are Alex K's Tune Zone. William Charles me on the cartoon fan, uh, Rob Corley, Virginia Media, Lola Maria, Mike is Chris, Chris Sport 2, Jazz Rachel and Clank, Julian Villarreal, and of course, the Matt Guy. Please check all those people out. Now, let's just get this program over with, alright? You know what? Let's just uh, get to work, alright? This is going to be a long show. What's up? What is a uh 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 what uh, uh, is a uh, uh, uh what uh, uh is a uh, uh what is a uh, uh, what is a uh, uh, what uh, uh is a uh, uh 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 what is a bum 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 What's up with Marissa Tomei, a woman who will work everywhere? Uh, she won't work for NBC though. She was on a show called A Different World, and she was fired after a while. Because nobody behind the scenes wanted to deal with ridiculous relationships.
Wow, that's the thing. Wait. Now hold on. She did only you in 1994. You had to be convinced by her favorite hairstylist to cut her hair. Or at least get a new hair. Wow. Just wow. Is she a diva? Yes. Uh, does she want to go Hollywood? Uh, yeah. All right. It is time for another topic. That's MP Pink Cat. Let's go. Does everybody know what time it is? Is it time for something that involves a weeknight update? That's correct. It's time for our top eight. Yeah, top eight to know what the top eight things are. Yeah, it's going to be great. Oh, I'm so excited. I wonder what the top eight is going to be this time. Well, we're going to have to figure it out. Well, Ellie's going to figure it out. Yeah, Tom, it's absolutely so. Well, then, what are we waiting for? Take it away, Ellie! Yeah! All right, boss, tonight's category, topic words that Marissa Tomei says all the time. Number eight, ouch! Number seven, what? Number six, ooh! Number five, no! Number four, please! Number three, hey! Number two, stop! And number one, ew! Okay, this is getting out of hand. You think? Thank you very much, boy. Thank you very much. You know, draw hashtag week up day, hashtag over for late night, hashtag over for a draw to my hashtag for love on hashtag all this rule. Get those things to draw on social media, please. And draw it right, like the thing, subscribe, make sure share, we can chat it up in the comment section down below. Alright, it's commercial time. But after these commercials, we're going to have Edward Scott, special delivery, the multiple assist, good to choir, a moment for everyone, and the all important talking time. Why are we going out for all those things? Well, all this show crazy, but also call this show Week and Update because that's the name of this program. Now, here it is, your Bob Knight. Welcome to Fitness for You. All right, we're going to start with some basics. Ready? Push-up position and roll down and take a nap. See you later. Nick at night. Fresh. Nick at night. All night, every night. Now in color or black and white. <sighs> if you have a house on Park Place, you don't need to worry about what it'll cost to carpet it. But most of us live over here in Baltic or Vermont, and we don't always have the ready cash. That's why Empire has such a super credit plan. Anyone who needs new carpeting shouldn't have to wait just because money is short. So our plan gives you 60 days to make an installment payment. 60 days. So go to your phone, go directly to your phone, do not pass go, and call Empire. 
Tom. On the lookout for a crab called the Sneaky Hermit, who's been in law and may have accomplices. Vroom. You're getting sloppy, boss. You're all over the news now. Yes, I know I'm supposed to be looking out, but here's what I see, boss. Moron. Imbecile. Superheroes, more like super losers. Cutie, I guess. This equipment must be malfunctioning. Greetings, stranger. Great scum! What can I get you fellas? A sea cucumber? A sea cucumber split? Information about any of major supervillains? Super what? No. No, I would like two scoops of high flavor ice cream with Fossil Man sprinkles. Mmm. Oh, I thought you were looking for a supervillain. You know who I'm talking about? Who's getting sneaky? There's a sailor of underpants. Uh, I mean, the sneaky hermit. That's the one. And you know, he's not really here. Maybe you should check somewhere at Bergie's. Oh my bullcraps, Captain! The sneaky hermit must be at Bergie's! We should go immediately. Well, I'm not hungry for one of these, but I'm happy to go to Bergie's! Away! <sighs> well, I got rid of them for you. Well, thank you for that. It's the only thanks you'll get. Great. Thanks. Now, really. What do you want? Oh, sorry about that, boss. But yes, the heroes are gone. But don't worry. I won't fail you like that again. Ah! This isn't my fault. What can I do for you, super villains? Oh, I knew these disguises wouldn't work. What a waste of two bucks. Uh, we're looking for the Sneaky Hermit's secret hideout. The secret one? That's just over the hill there. Well, that was easy. Sure. All the signs. You can't miss it. Disability Choir. Damien, you say that he got a confusion. Long live Cookie Bun Cooper and Sonic the Hedgehog. Come to our library, can do an experiment. Long live Cookie Bun Cooper and Sonic the Hedgehog. We can do anything for our friends. And they Charles and Jim are very happy with our adventures. Since Scratch murdered Charles and Jim are Long live Cookie Bun Cooper and Sonic the Hedgehog. Now we must protect Fiona since she has PTSD. Long live Cookie Bun Cooper and Sonic the Hedgehog. Now that mind these have we fight for good. And now Fiona has PTSD no more, yeah. Long live Cookie Bun Cooper and Sonic the Hedgehog. Do you call me the Quacket? How's your Quacket Sprung Do you wait to skip me before me? Well, we found it that just we sort it out for you. Long live Cookie Bun Cooper and Sonic the Hedgehog. Genius is quite fine. Can you teach Star Coach now? Long live Cookie Bun Cooper and Sonic the Hedgehog. You made this year. That was 
was perfect. And now, let's have more for everyone, shall we? Hey, Rebel, do you know what time it is? Uh, no, the camel lady, what time is it? Well, Rebel, it's time for a moment for everyone. I wonder what Ellie is going to say this time. Well, we're about to find out right now. Yeah, so take it away, Ellie. Yeah, Ellie. Love you, my smoochy poo. <sighs> Some people want to know if cannibalism still exists. By the way, cannibalism is the act of eating other human beings. Now, here's the thing, all right? It does exist, but it's rare. Let me explain why, all right? Modern science suggests that humans are not good to eat for other humans because eating the brain of another human can cause coup, which is a brain disease that's similar to mad cow disease. The reason why is this. Look, human brains contain prions that transmit the disease. And the symptoms begin with trembling and, and, you know, uh, very, and, and something extremely tragic. And I don't even want to uh, go that far. All right. The bottom line is this. All right. There are a few cannibals in the world right now. And I want you to be very, very, very careful. All right. Because if you're not careful, then a cannibal will get you. All right. How do you protect yourself? from uh, being eaten by a cannibal? Well, simple. Just run away if you see a cannibal. And whatever you do, do not let that cannibal into your own home, all right? No, nope. so folks, please keep all the cannibals away from you at all times. And Please keep them away from your loved ones as well. All right? Trust me. You'll thank me for this later. Now, I believe there is talking time. Here we go. Hey, do you know what time it is? That's right. It's talkie time to know what Ellie is talking about. So, let's talk about it. And don't tickle me, please. Listen to this, all right? Marissa Tomei was actually on a show entitled A Different World. And at the time, it was a show on, that's right, NBC. Uh, he was only on that show for one year. But here's the reason why. All right. There was a storyline that she didn't really want to do. Debbie Allen, who took over as the producer for the show after the show's first year, said this. You know, she said, I thought that she and Adine Wayne, Wayne would be friends. We could do an episode where she actually goes home with him for Thanksgiving and it would be, you know, guess who's coming to dinner. And then his mom would not like it, him coming home with a little, uh, little white girl, and I thought this would be great to show the reverse racism or to show those kinds of down. Now, the reason why Debbie Allen wanted to do that was because he wanted Melissa's character to have range. Now, here's the thing, all right? The executives did not like that idea. 
and neither did Marissa. So you know what happened? Marissa got the boot. That's right, Marissa got fired. And I think that everything worked out for pretty much everybody. Well, except, of course, for the people who were responsible for a different war. Let's take a look at this. You know, a few years after he got fired from a different war and from NBC, she was hired by a few Hollywood directors to do the classic movie, Only You. That's right. She did it along with Robert Downey Jr. That's right. Now, here's the thing, right? In that movie, Marissa rocked an interesting haircut. But she almost didn't get that haircut. You wanna know why? Because Marissa said, oh no, 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 no. I like my hair just the way it is. Alright? And she had to be convinced to get that haircut. And she said that I only get the best hair do from the best hairstylist in the world. Although Signoretti or Signoretti. So the producers got a hold of uh, Aldo and somehow were able to manage to get Marissa to get the hair. Yeah, I know. It's insane and it's wild. But then again, that's Hollywood for you. That is Hollywood. Now, this episode of Week Now Update is over. All right, thank you so much for watching. I'll see you back here again tomorrow night. All right, that is the news, and I am out. Peace, four by four. And cut! <laughs> That's a wrap! Great show, everybody! You all did a great job. Thanks, Ellie. Yeah, thanks. Until tomorrow's show, everybody! Okay! Hey, you freaking fools! You slept through the whole show! Who's a fool? Yeah! You watched it! <laughs> Nick at night. Fresh. Nick at night. All night, every night. Now in color or black and white. Ah.